Hi, I'm Ollie. In this review, we're going to be taking a look at the Armour Bodyguards. And just give you a quick look at the packaging before I open it up. It's a carbon fibre overlay for the iPhone 5. So uh, what you get, you get three layers. You've got a scratch proof film. You've also got the uh, the graphics layer and then the uh, the adhesive layer that actually allows you to take it on and off. So the idea is, um, if you don't want it on, you can take it off, put it back on whether you like, switch it between phones. So what I'm going to do is going to be a two part review. Um, so I'll open this up. I haven't even had a chance to look at it. It's just arrived today. So uh, if we open up the packaging, just show you about the uh, the contents, and then I'll I'll apply it the best I can. And, uh, and I'll uh, film the uh, the second part and merge the videos together. Uh, I'm not really a massive fan of screen protectors, so I'm not that great at it. What you get here, you get a moisture wipe, so you can uh, cl clean the phone. You've also got this application gel, which I presume is to, uh, to help smooth out any bubbles and just make the uh, application easier. You've got a microfiber cleaning cloth and also a couple of stickers um, representing the brand. And here we've got an instruction guide, so I'll, uh, I'll read through that and uh, give you some feedback once I've applied it. Got a diagram there of how it actually fits on. So what we've got here is this will be the actual uh, the front part, um, so that's clear. So that's pretty much like a, a full body screen protector. And, uh, and also what we've got here is this is the actual carbon fibre bit. So you've got the part that runs across the top, each side. And actually, the uh, the carbon fiber overlay itself, as you can see, it's uh, it's a really neat looking pattern. I don't think it's genuine carbon fiber, but it definitely looks a real thing. So I'll have a quick look into that. Um, so the next stage is I'm going to apply it onto a, a black iPhone 5 and uh, and see what it looks like. Right, I've decided to make this uh, kind of an installation guide as well, so uh, you can hopefully see how uh, how well or bad this actually goes for me. Um, looking in the manual, you've got two ways of applying the. Uh, this kit you've got a gel application or a dry the dry one means once it's on um, you can't remove it and reuse it but it does mean that you can use it straight away whereas with the gel application you do have to wait half an hour to an hour before the phone's uh, ready to use again but you can reapply it so I'm going to go for the gel application this time um, so first thing we need to do is we need to clean the phone so I'll just get my iPhone 5 and what we've got here we've got an antibacterial moisture wipe Let's tear that open so you're probably going to go on for quite a while, so if you get bored at any moment, obviously just skip through to the relevant part. But if you're actually considering buying the product, then it's probably well worth uh, worth watching. Another thing you want to do is you want to make sure your hands are nice and clean, because uh, the last thing you want to do is get all uh, all grease over the phone after you've uh, you've cleaned it. So I'm not going to be uh, concentrating on the screen protector at the uh, today, but I am going to uh, going to put the uh, the carbon fiber part on, so give the phone a proper clean. So what we'll do, we'll just pop that down and uh, next thing you need to do is uh, according to the instructions uh, we, uh, we get the back part here which we want to uh, apply to the phone and, uh, and we need to apply that to the actual, uh, actual back of the phone after we put some of the application gel on. 